better than no dominatrix. That is the truth. That is the truth. All right, you guys ready for Adam? Yeah. Adam White, everybody. How you doing? My name is Adam Wade. I'm originally from New Hampshire. Uh, two years ago, uh, I had two jobs and I was working six days a week, and mostly seven days a week. When I had a day off, it was like laundry day. There was not time really to do much. And the way I am, I'm kind of a nerd in the sense that when I'm working like that, I'm very diligent and I have like my, make my sandwiches for the week. I do stuff like that and I sleep. And like my, I had to be in Monday through Friday at 8.30, so I would get up at 7, and I would, I need eight hours sleep, or I get really cranky, I could be a prick. Uh, <laughs> so I had everything ready for the next morning, and I would go to bed right at 11 o'clock. I wouldn't stay up for the day, I'd write to bed at 11, you know, I would meditate uh, in bed. Uh, my friends, they didn't have an intervention, but they said, wait, like, you know, for like six months, we, we never hear from you, you never come out, like, what's wrong with you? I go, hey, listen. I'm trying to make it here. And they're like, fuck that, you're trying to make it. Like, you, you got to come out and have a good time. It's like, you, you always look like you're stressed, and you're just like, you're, you're coming out with this. So well, I went to Brother Jimmy's on the Upper East Side because we knew one of the bartenders. And my friend Dave kind of got a bunch of our buddies there. And uh, I'm a lightweight when it comes to drinking. Um, so when we got there, I ate a lot of wings because I get thirsty with the hot wings. And, and we were, I was drinking Pabst Blue Ribbon and uh, Soko shots, and they had a fishbowl thing, and I drank out of that a little. I don't like sharing, but I was trying. I mean, you know, Adam, you got to go under a new leaf. So we're going there, and I was drunk. And when I'm drunk, I, I, I either get very loud, and like, hey, hey, or I get a little sexy. And when I say sexy, I don't even care. <laughs> Like, what's going on? So, like, oh, I'm like scared of the room, but a little borderline for me. I was like, oh, all right. And like, nobody, nobody's even looking back at me. I'm like, I was sober, and nobody's looking back at me. And, and, and then uh, there was like this like petite girl, and, and, and she nudged me, and I go, oh, excuse me. And I was sitting, and she's like, no. And she nudged me again. I go, excuse me. And she's like, no, hello. And I'm Jane. I'm like, Jane, nice to meet you. And she's like, would you like to play ski ball? And they have like a little ski ball machine. And I go, oh, yeah, sure. And, and all the guys are going crazy. They're like, wait, wait, wait. So I'm excited. <laughs> so I played ski ball with her, and like what my friend later said, he's in Davies. He's a nice guy. He's in a wrestling. He said she looked like a petite China, the professional wrestler. She was very like muscular, but and, and that's like, and managed by like petite. And I, I like it was something about her like I liked. Okay, so um, so I'm doing ski ball, and I'm really good at ski ball. And to me, when I do ski ball, um, like I, I'm not an extremely confident a woman. But with ski ball, I'm very good at it. And, it. and it takes me back because I'm from New Hampshire. We play, we go to the Hampton Beach and we play ski ball with my parents. And then we win tickets and we buy the, the boats, like the models, and we put them in. And, the, and like, I'm doing well, so my confidence is a little bit better. And so in between playing, like, she kind of moved me and I just, I, I was good. Like, I, I, I probably was just grabbing something, but I grabbed it and we started making out and things were good. <laughs> I, I went home with her to a story. I, I don't usually do that. This was like a big deal. I've never done that before. <laughs> Uh, so a story. I live in Hoboken, and, and we went to her place, <laughs> and uh, so uh, and things went well. Things I was very happy with the situation, and like this was like a new life, Adam Wade, new leaf, and, and and like and I had this, and I was getting booty call type calls. I, I wouldn't call it a booty, but it was. I mean, she was saying come over, and it was one o'clock, and in Hoboken, I'd have to go to the path, take four off, go over, and then, then then take the end, and then go, and and then it was great. And then I was what I was doing was I was. Uh, I, there was a de like a diner, Greek diner, half Greek, and I would get a gyro on the ride home. Like, I, I, cause I think like don't stay the night because you want to let all my friends don't stay there because then she's gonna think you want a relationship. You just want to keep going there. So it's like four or five days a week, and like I was hardly sleeping, and, and but it was great, and, and like I would go and I'd always have I, the diet was bad. I was eating the year. I, I'd bring Pepto Bismol tablets, so like I'd wake up in my apartment. And like Jesus Christ, like like I tough to get up, and then I look in the mirror to shave it. I'd have like powder all over my face from the pink uh, tablets. But it was great. I was living the life. I was living the life, Adam. Way this was good. And uh, and I had like a notebook. I'm like, now you're this new guy. You're gonna start writing notes. And and I roll like this is no joke. I roll one night coming back. I'm like, this would be a great Cinemax movie. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, the traveler, uh, but uh, like like all this, like I wasn't sleeping and I was starting to get cranky. And like the first, I'm telling you, I, I am I'll be, I'll God on. The first four weeks were heaven, but I started getting a little cranky because I wasn't sleeping, and I, and and it was tough. And, and she 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 could feel it. 
you know, and, and, and like one night, you know, I, I had to be at 7 o'clock to set up the breakfast for work and stuff, and, and so I would have to get up at 5, 30, and, and, and like, so she, she called it like at, at midnight, she's like, come over. I go, hey, listen, I can't come over. I, I got to work. I mean, and like, it was very uncharacteristic, and she wasn't, and, and it was like our first fight, and, and, and she's like, well, okay. I go, okay, and we hung, hung up, and, and then like I went to bed, and I felt bad. I'm like, all right, it's, it's 12 o'clock if I go. 12.15 if I go and come back and shower and go. So I went and I brought a bottle of wine. I went at a wedding. I went to like the priest give, I, I answered the question right, how to bury the, the tomatoes or something. But it was like the wine that you make communion with. But I was like, what the fuck? I, got, I can't go empty handed. So I get there and, and I go to a door and it's like, it's like 1.15, one thing. I knock on the door and I go, Miss Pussycat, Miss Pussycat, meow, meow, meow. It's Wade, the big dog, Roof. Like, like she role played. Like, uh, I'm not good at role playing, but that was the dog, and she was a kitty cat. And, and, like, she was there. So, Miss Pussy. So she opens the door, and, like, she just has a shirt on, and she's disheveled, and she smells like, like sex or something. Like she, and, and I was nervous, and, I'm, and she's like, what are you doing here? I go, well, we got in a fight. I brought a bottle of wine. Let's, let's, get, let's make up. <laughs> and and, and she's, like, she's like, well, you're my number one, but... When my number one's not ready, I go for my number two. And I'm like, what is this, like, like the deli line? And, and I was like, fuck it in. And I was like, this is So I, I left. And I'm like, going home, I was trying to comfort myself by saying, well, at least you are number one. But it didn't really. <laughs> so I knew it was over. And I thought to myself, maybe you should get back to me in the old Adam way because you're, you're not the same. And your, your, your job, you're not doing well. And what I really got to know was I have wants and I have needs but my number one is sleep 